Food is chicken tenders. Yeah, 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 yeah. He isn't sweater, yeah, bitch, just doesn't know which gender. Throwing Nero's team into a blender. His job is a micro bender. You can hear his boom like thunder. Yeah. Yoshi the fights, there's no delay. He hates bullets, always portrays. When you see his clips, you always replay. Hero's team is always astray. Always answer truthfully in a survey. It's a bird, it's a plane, no, it's not just. Oh, uh, what's everybody? It's energy today. It's freaking hot out here. It's not because of me. I mean, look at my face. It says it all. No, it's because I'm in a goddamn desert, for goddamn sake. Oh, God. Just give me a second, I gotta do it with this. Oh yeah! Oh, oh better now, let's go. Woo, now fired up! Alright. Whew! Oh yeah, what we're doing again? Oh yeah, because I'm in the desert, we should just rank all the sky under desert levels. My god, just water in my eye. Why'd I do that? Alright, so at the number six spot, we got Serpent's Peak. Now, you don't even probably even know what this is. And it is. It's just the Fire Viper boss fight. Now, Swell Force, you probably know, has this thing where they separate the boss fights from the levels. So, the boss fights are like their own levels. So, I was like, you know what? I, inc I included Twisty Tunnels on this ranking. So, I was like, you know what? Might as well just include the Fire Viper boss fight, which is called Serpent's Peak. So, let's talk about it. So, the Fire Viper fire viper boss fight itself it's all right um you have to i guess i don't know like launch plungers at the fire fire viper go on top of it crush the crystals on it uh rinse and repeat and then you go inside the fire viper drop down it's <laughs> it's a mouth which is weird but it's not that disgusting surprisingly and you just had to destroy the crystals in there. Um, yeah, pretty simple here. Um, I, it's not gonna get far on this list because it's just a boss fight. But, hey, yeah, that, that's all I really have to say. Alright, so at the number 5th spot, we got Twisty Tunnels. Now, I already mentioned Twisty Tunnels um, in the last placement, but now we're gonna talk about it as a whole. Yeah, this is just a boring level to me. Um, you know, you got these sections where you go inside a crystal and then you get tiny. Um, you do these platform sections. It's, it's fine, but not really. And it's special. Sometimes a fire viper comes out of nowhere, spits fireballs at you. Um, <laughs> still, eh. And, um, oh yeah, I forgot. Turret sections. Everybody's favorite. Oh, gotta love those. <laughs> Anyways, uh, overall, definitely just a boring level um, and I don't really have much to say about it <laughs> alright so that's the number uh, four spot we got the golden desert now this is just a filler level it feels like um, not really much happens when it comes to the story in this level now you're probably saying oh my god Callie gets turned into gold by the golden queen well that really does not matter <laughs> it really doesn't because she just gets turn back to normal in the next level like nothing impactful about it nothing like oh my god what oh my god no it really does not matter in the slightest <laughs> um i mean the gray clobber he appears a hero like that but okay nice <laughs> and like the what's it called like those chompies there's like a special type of chompies like the worm chompies that you get to like shoot catapults at. Um, okay, it's a fine segment. Um, yeah, it's just a fine level in general. Alright, so at the number first ball, we got Iron Jaw Gulch. Now, it's a pretty solid level. That's why it's halfway through the list. Um, nothing really horrible about it, but nothing absolutely spectacular about it. Um, you know, you have these like trampoline sections. I mean, they they could be fun, I guess. <laughs> and um, you're basically just helping like the shark dudes um, blow up Grebo airships. That's pretty much the premise of this level. But I do gotta give this level something. The whole western, wild west feel of this level uh, is actually really nice. Um, it's pretty unique as well. 
Our right, so the number second spot on our list, we got the layer of the Golden Queen. So the Golden Queen boss fight is it? <laughs> oh my god. I, I have to talk about it first because it's just that good. Um, even though, the, like the, the phase at the end where she just rushes at you, um, and rampages and tries to absolutely sm just splatter you like a bug. Yeah, that gave me, uh, lots of nightmares when I was younger. Not, not now, but when I was younger. <laughs> and, um, I mean, the whole level itself, uh, fits with Golden Queen, and, uh, there's, like, coffins all over the place, there's pretty nice puzzles, I guess, uh, Bad Juju, of course, Bad Juju, and, uh, <laughs> yeah, a really nice enemy variety as well. Um, yeah, it's a pretty good level, uh, not, nothing more, nothing less. It's just a good level. Alright, so at number first spot, we got Motleyville. Now, looking back at this list, Squat Force really likes their desert levels, but uh, Motleyville absolutely smashes it. Um, and Baron Von Shellshock just he made this level. Like, without him, this level wouldn't be as good, I feel like. Um, I mean, Evil Eyes Whiskers, though. Pretty nice, but Baron Von Shellshock, his personality is awesome. <laughs> uh, the whole rusted theme, like the whole metal scraps everywhere, you know, it's, that's pretty cool too. And Sharpen is also introduced in this level, which is nice to see. Uh, the whole level overall, I mean, it comes with every Swamp Force level, it's pretty long, but it's still enjoyable. Um, and yeah, that's why Mollyville is in the number first spot for the desert level ranking. So, I really like Skylander desert levels. I mean, not all of them, but they can be really good. Now, usually with desert levels, they pretty much hit or miss with me. Um, some desert levels can be really, 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 really bad, but some desert levels can be spectacular. Like, come on. <laughs> and, um, most of the time, Skylanders does their desert levels correct. Uh, hope you guys enjoyed this video. Uh, this was really fun to make, actually. And the first, you know, <laughs> the first clip of the video was uh, really fun to make, especially. So, yeah. If you guys want to see, you know, more skits or more stupid stuff like that, um, yeah, tell me <laughs> if you guys enjoy that. So, yeah. Um, Peace out. Boom, bada, bing, chame. Woo. The way he hates bullets, always for trace. When you see his clips, you always replay. Hero's team is always.